Okay, today we're going to take a look at Disk Drill. It is a data recovery and more software. I have a license, enterprise version license for it, which means I can test every single thing that's to be tested on it. But before we do anything else, we're going to check the other tools that come with it. We have the smart tool that it can do analysis and reporting in uh, hard drives and their reliability and so you know more information to avoid issues with that hardware which means your hard drives you have data protection as it says right here recovery vault is a unique data protection algorithm by Cle uh, clever files fast efficient and all that stuff so it protects your file from being overwritten just adding a little bit additional space to that drive so you prevent it from overriding. Okay, we got that part. Byte to byte backup. That means a mirror image of a storage uh, device. So that's how we do call it in day-to-day -day life. Here they call it just byte to byte backup. I like that name. And then you have a cleanup. You can clean up a disk that you have. For example, let's say you have a C drive or whatever. You know the files that are in there, you would think they're just maybe, I don't know, 50 gigabytes. But somehow in the drive, you have 70 gigabytes taken. Well, a lot of times you have temporary files, junk files, and all that stuff. You go here. Okay, let's do it with a cleanup. And you can go ahead and do whatever you need to clean up. We're not going to do it here because we are here to test a USB drive that I'm going to plug right in right now is we want to test really the uh recoverability on this uh software the drive is empty right now i'm going to throw these uh pictures there will be four of them as you see these are just the uh, ai images that i made for fun and we will see if disk drill will get them back for us after we do something really bad to this drive we're gonna first format it with a normal format this is the new drive and let it format. So this one is gone. Okay. And now we're going to do the other format, uh, which is a little bit of a worse wiper. Let's format it from here. We go to this part, list disks. Okay. And our disk is the last one, disk number seven. Select disk seven. Okay. Now what we're going to do to disk seven, eh, we're going to wipe it clean, clean and boom. It is done now. So we double wiped it in a way. Uh, let's see if we still have it here. Yep. New volume. We have to remount it. If you click on it, as you see, it says, please insert. We have to go to devices or device manager. We have to go to disk and check for disk manager. And here we have computer management or disk management. We go to the disk and wait for it to populate really quick. Okay. Now we have to find our drive that we wiped. It's this one right here. Simple volume. That means this went through the ringer. Okay. And uh, we're just going to name it USB, a very creative name. And we're going to finish. Now it will be recognized by our system. Just give it a second. Okay. Now the drive is good. Remember, we put those four pictures on it. Now it has been wiped with a normal format and the other format through disk part. So now we're going to go to storage devices. And we're going to find this device and try to recover from it. So it's this one right here, Sony storage, all that. And we're going to hit search for lost data. Okay. We're going to hit this one. Somehow it says exception and stuff missing. Uh, we're going to wait for it to finish because it will get here. Eight pictures we have here. Uh, let's see what those pictures actually are. This was a little bit too fast, even though it's going to recover more. So you have to wait quite a lot until it actually finishes. If you go here to dashboard, it is still going on only five, six percent. So when it's finished exploring and trying to recover everything that has ever been on this device, we will see if our pictures are there. But based on what I'm seeing so far on that empty drive, we have more than those pictures because it found 36 pictures, two videos, audio not yet, six documents, six archives, and one others, which would be probably, I don't know, remainders of Windows installation files. Anyway, we'll be back when it's done recovering from this uh, USB and we'll see what uh, cookies do we have on it. Okay, so all recovery methods were complete. And as you saw, this is only an 8 gig uh, USB, but somehow it found over 15 gigs 
of data inside first i'm gonna look for those pictures really quick that's good luck finding them but we will uh, check as you see here's one of our pictures that is interesting that's our second picture third picture and fourth picture that is amazing that is absolutely beautiful and these are just other random pictures that were on this uh usb before and as you see they're all good to go that is perfect and now we have of course other stuff we have videos we have audio we have documents we have archives others there is a lot there's literally a lot here and we're gonna just uh, get all of them recover all to a drive of our choosing save all files to one folder obviously because i don't want to scatter them all around and we're gonna hit next and now the recovery of over 1400 files is in progress and when this part is done we will get back and all the files should be openable but we're gonna focus on those four pictures of a car and i will choose some uh pictures that were there from way 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 before to see if it did a good job actually reconstruction reconstructing those bits of uh memory okay so it took around 40 minutes for all the files to be recovered and i'm just gonna see what happened how many did we get now there's a a lot of files that's still going through and recovery and all that stuff but for now we're just gonna focus on these four which is this one right here as you see perfect you can zoom in and out really nice the second no breaking nothing uh third perfect and the fourth amazing and now this is some really old footage and as you see it actually reads no problem so it is really playable and usable even though some of this is really really some old stuff as you see just me filming a, an older laptop that's been quite a while ago and it's just perfect recovered and done and these are just uh icons i guess but it is recovering more data which I'm not going to go through the whole thing here because that's a lot of it. But I just hope you get the point here of what we are trying to do and what we just did with this drill. It's really that good. And with that said, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learned something. Yes, this was disk drill enterprise version 5.5.9 uh, as the recording of this video and we'll see you next time link will be down in the description it is not affiliated just in case you want it or need it you can check it out and we'll see you next time